Yo, what is up gamers? Welcome back, Erok here. We're going to be doing the Signal 50 uh, sniper rifle. If you want to see a uh, loadout for aesthetics uh, at the end, do stick around, but we're going to start with the rear grips as always. So for rear grip, we have the stalwart uh, grip, we have the Cronin blockade grip, and we have the SA finesse uh, grip. Stock options are the following. FSS Echo Stock, uh, SO S0 Inline Stock, and the FTAC Invisi 670 Stock. Optics are the following. We have, first of all, XRK On Point Optic, the DF uh, 105 Reflex Sight, the Monocle CT90, the Corvus SOL 76, the SZ Recharge DX, the SZ SRO uh, 7, the Corio uh, REX Pro, the Corio Enforcer Optic, the SZ Lone Wolf Optic, the Kazan Holo, the Corvus Downrange, the SZ Holotherm, the X10 Angel 40, the VLK 4x Optic, the Schlager 4x, the Forge TAC Delta 4, the Cronin 0P Optic, the SZ Bullseye Optic, the SZ Aggressor IR Optic, the Schlager Night View Optic, the VX350 Thermal Optic, the Teplo OP3 Scope, the DR582 Hybrid Sight, the Hybrid Firepoint, the SZ Vortex 90, the BPZ40 uh, uh, Hybrid, the Angel uh, 40 4.8 time, the Thermo Optic X9, the Teplo, Teplo Clear Shot, the FTAC Charlie 7, the HMW uh, 20 Optic, the Lucascope, the Drexum Prime 90, the Ares Clear Shot, the DXS Coriolis uh, V4, the Lackman Impact 9, the SPX 86.6 time, the FTAC Locus SP, the SZ Heat Source 800, the MCPR 309.5 time, the Victus 13 time, the Sightmax Clear Shot, the Corio 13 time via VRS, and finally the Raptor FM, uh, FVM 40. That's a lot of sights. Well, that's a sniper rifle, so that tracks does make sense. Lasers, we have the following lasers. The SZ 1mW PEQ, the Schlager PEQ Box 4, the Corio LAS um, 44V3, the FSS 5 laser, the 1mW laser box, the Stovel DR laser box, Corvus PEQ Beam 5, the FTAC Grimline Laser, the Luminate 44, and the DXS Flash 90. For barrels, we have three barrel options, starting with the FSS Jetstream, 21.5 inch fluted uh, 50, and the 29 inch uh, TV kil Kilo uh, 50. For muzzles, we have the following options. We have the Bruin Agent 90 silencer. We have the Nil Sound 90 silencer. The H26 uh, ported comp. The Legion fire compensator. And the Demon Helix XL. Under barrels, we have the following options. We have the Level Aim bipod. The Cornerstone bipod. The X10 stable shot. The Edge 47 grip, the Demo Firm grip, the X10 Gravedigger, 
the FTAC Ripper 56, the Demo Clean Shot, the Demo IMP 44 Grip, the FTAC Tiger Grip, the FSS Shark Fin 90, the Agent uh, Grip, the Bruin Sink Shot Grip, the X10 Drop Grip, the Merc 4 Grip, the Lock Grip Precision 40, the Hex 40 Grip, the Schlager Tango, the VX Pineapple, the 0P X9 Foregrip, the Operator Foregrip, TV Wrecker Grip, the Bruin Tilt Grip, the Cronin Groove Shot Grip, the Bruin Warrior Grip, and that's it for the grips. Again, quite a few grips. Ammunition options are the following. We've got the uh, 50 cal uh, frangible, We've got the 50 cal armor piercing, and the 50 cal um, explosive. And finally, magazine options. We have just the one seven round mag. Um, and yeah, that's it. Uh, okay, I'm going to do a, um, a, a loadout for... Um, there's not much to do, to be honest. I think what would look sort of cool, not necessarily best looking, but maybe something like this. Um, and we have to put we put this compensator and maybe a um, a bipod, something like this. Need a beefy boy. Maybe a length and barrel as well. I like the look of this though, I have to say. And maybe a slightly changed up grip. How about that? I think that looks pretty dope. I don't know what you guys think. Um, okay, so I'm going to do a showcase after this. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Seriously, if you don't subscribe, you're a b****s goal, and you don't want to be a b****s goal, okay? That's just, um, yeah, that's just reserved for certain types of gamers that you do not want to be. You do not want to be a b****s goal. Subscribe, motherfucker.